Alright, this is Jericho here, and it's a wait a minute production. There's a new re Thai restaurant near Bukit, uh, no, near Bujaya Times Square, and this is it, I think. And it's the opening night, so uh, it should be an interesting time. So I'm not going to do any reviews about food because it's a type of buffet. And I uh, don't know what's it called, this new restaurant. It looks bloody huge. Okay, there are lots of people for this opening. I think it's called the restaurant. Uh, no idea. It's Chinese writing and stuff. A lot of flowers everywhere. It should be nice. See you later, mates. Kimchi, I think. drinking this martel with tropical punch tastes kind of nice mm. Mm, not bad not bad this is like uh, orange with lots of alcohol mm. I haven't eaten yet I think I should eat because it's quite uh, quite late already about 9 p.m. I'll finish this first before I eat This is the sweet and sour chicken. Excellent. This is a brinjal with curries, spices and stuff. Excellent. The kung kung here is very firm, very not overcooked, and it's another excellent. This is one of the uh, vegetables with the glass noodles and the glass noodles are very thick and it's full of flavor and it's really really good but when it comes to kimchi i have no experience in it so i cannot give a mark for this one i don't actually like kimchi so i'm going to leave it as that So this restaurant is called Ko Ryo. Now I finally know the name. I'm gonna give my reviews now. When I'm having a nice smoke and a nice good drink of whiskey and orange. I'm <laughs> slightly a bit drunk, but it's okay. So this is a new restaurant, a Korean restaurant, in a very, very secluded area. It's near the residential uh, area, in, in fact. And I can see a, a building with a yellow sign uh, that states it's Dorset. So, and you can see this, there's the KL Tower here. Yep, this KL Tower. So those are your, your bearings to get to this place. It's quite a big area. Uh, a very, very big restaurant yep indeed
the, this is a new restaurant and it's opened or today's official opening is at the uh, I think around 26th of uh, June of 2013 and I can say if their buffet style type of food is reflected in their normal type of food I guess this restaurant will do extremely well because I really did enjoy the buffet food and that's not because of the alcohol even though I'm a bit pretty smashed because of the martini or martin so it was really good the glass noodles were excellent the sweet and sour chicken was good everything was good about it the rice was all right and somebody say, stated that it was Japanese rice but I have no experience in anything Japanese or anything that's rice Japanese related if you can if you know that if you can feel that I'm inco incoherent it's because that I am a bit drunk yeah, I'm doing a full review so everything here is really really good and I have never given in a place a five star five stars out of five that's a great achievement for something that's open for the first night if it continues to have such um, what you call consistent results I think this restaurant will be doing really well even though it's in the heart of KL which uh, makes it quite inaccessible because of the jams and all those bullshit things that uh, that is associated with uh, capital city but I guess it would do well so this has been a Jericho production and also a wait a minute production so see you in Malaysia bye bye